spiritual soul in the building. Geyser, geyser. Nature so in the building, man. Sample. Am I looking at the camera because it's dark as hell? Geyser, geyser. In the building. Smooth skin so in the building. Do we so in the building? Hoodie so in the building, man. Sample. Simple. So check this out. I'm about to record this shit real quick in my car. Why? I don't know. Cause I was literally about to dip. I hopped in my car on my like. I just gotta record this shit now. I'm not gonna try to make this video too long. The chosen ones listen to me and listen to me very carefully. I'm talking to you like I'm FaceTiming you. I hope you've been taking care of yourself. And focus on your fucking self. We in the matrix. It's crumbling. Before I talk about anything, I want to say this right now. Because I just got done talking to a person in my emails. Another person about some stuff. I want to say this right now. If you somebody that have anybody in your family that's been affected in a negative way by all these vaccines. That y'all had to go through. Because Corona gone. They not talking about this shit no more. It's gone. What happened to Where Where's Corona? Gone. You still gotta take that, but the shit is gone. It's off the media. They ain't, they got enough people now. If you somebody who's been affected in a negative way by these shits and you don't feel yourself, put it in the comments. I know it's other people that can relate to your story. If you somebody that got some loved ones in your family that's been affected in a negative way by these, no matter if they caught cancer, no matter if they ended up passing away, and if you somebody that's any type of negative thing happened in. In any way, put it in the comments. I guarantee you it's somebody that can relate to your situation. One of the things that I want to tell y'all right now, half of America, and I'm only talking about America right now because what y'all see happening in America, it's way worse outside of the country and every other country. I've been telling y'all this. Half of America right now is sleep. They're, they living in a root chakra. They at the lowest form of self. They living in fear. The broke them the fuck down they acceptable for everything they gonna believe anything that comes on the media the media control america there is no government these politicians that y'all see most of these niggas is dead most of them is cgi they not that's every time y'all see biden he gonna look different i'm not saying he fake every time you see him he gonna look different i'm not saying he's a clone every time you see him he gonna look different i'm not saying he a demon Every time you see him, he going to look different. Let me tell y'all this. The media is controlling America. There is no government or politicians that's running shit and all this. The media. The media is the president. It's the media. So everybody was, y'all know I've been on YouTube fighting my wars. Fighting my battles with these badass entertainers. A lot of shit that probably don't make sense to y'all make perfectly sense to the chosen ones. Spiritually. A lot of shit that's happening physical. Don't make sense to you, but it make perfectly sense to us spiritually. We've been talking about it for the past three years. This is a spiritual war, right? So I've been all over YouTube and people on my spiritual channel been telling me, hey, so when did you go come back and talk about the World War Three? So just today I went and I started because I already seen it all on Twitter and stuff, but I just didn't attach my energy to it because I knew it was fake. I knew it. I knew it. So I start doing my research. Y'all know I always tap into Russian servers. I take certain words and I put it in the translate and then I put it in. I translate it to English so I can see what's going on. I take a lot of time out my day to really tap in. I'm going to leave links in the description. I got live video footage in Ukraine of all these areas that they saying this war is going on. Nothing is happening. They I'm going to post on my community. They showing y'all a news article and it's just one. I caught a lot of them, but they be deleting a lot of stuff when you start exposing them. Because, listen, they got a lot of botted accounts that be fake liking and retweeting certain tweets. It be If you click and look at the retweets and the likes, it be fake accounts. They got botted accounts that push fake news articles and shit to the top and make it trend. Some of the news articles be from 2018, 2015. I'm going to show y'all they posted a news article about a fucking one bloody ass woman who posed that had got bombed pushing all this fear. But it was from 2018. And then when you expose them, they delete it. Now, listen, I already told y'all plenty of times about crisis actors. I already told y'all plenty of times about everything. Let me ask you a real question. Why the if they lie to you about the pandemic, 
and they lied straight to your face about everything. Fired healthcare workers who've been helping and saving lives for years. Took jobs, shut down everything, lied, made you get something that now you know you never needed. If they went that far to kill your family and to do this to you, what makes you think they won't lie to you about a fucking war? Every time the wars shit happen, America suffer. Gas prices rise, all this weird shit, right? Y'all motherfuckers really think putty Putin is a, a threat. He's a fucking puppet. They all working together. They all sit at the table and figure out how can we do something to completely destroy the world because this shit is over. Now, let's talk spiritual. I told y'all it's a new energy and vibration here on this planet and I've been saying this shit for the past two years. A lot of your loved ones has been affected in a negative way. You think it's because something that's physical, but I promise you, they it don't matter if they was working out, if they was spiritually lower vibration than the vibration that is on this planet, they were they was gonna slowly get sick and die off anyway. Like I'm not it's they are ascending. Like spiritually, they so probably already know. Like, dude, this is what I'm trying to tell y'all. These motherfuckers can't run. They can't hide from the sun. They can't do nothing. Let me talk about Australia real quick. Because Australia is close to Antarctica. Y'all know everything we know about Antarctica is a lie. They want all y'all to look at the media. They don't want y'all to look up. They don't want y'all to look within. They don't want y'all to connect with nature. They want y'all to connect with the media. Antarctica. If you live in Antarctica. I mean, I said Antarctica. If you live in Australia. If you live in New Zealand, you got all type of footage of different planets all in your fucking sky. You got all type of footage of different shit in your atmosphere that we don't see in America. We don't never get a chance to see nothing outside of the country. That's that. Bro, listen, remember I told y'all it's different planets, it's different beings here. It's different beings, it's different planets, different vibrational beings, different shit that you never seen before in your life. Shit that you think you see in movies and cartoons is here. It's a whole nother reality. Now, if you bought it in your lower shoot, your root chakra, you don't see nothing. You're not experiencing anything. You're dead. I'm just sorry. But if you've been taking care of yourself this entire time, you see it. You feel it. You see it. You witnessing it. Australia, they got all type of sightings. They got all type of different clouds, cloak shit. It's all type of different new planets that they're not talking about. It has nothing to do with Mars, Jupiter, this and that and that and this. It's new energy here on the planet. They have to keep you distracted because if you if you pay attention, you will literally realize, bro, this shit is over. Every all right, y'all. My bad, dude. I'm just so passionate about this shit. I'm hot. I'm sweaty. So listen, this is the last thing I want to tell you right now. And you need to really hear, you need to really hear me right now. And this is the last thing I want to tell you. And this is what's about to take place. This is what's about to take place. It's a pattern. It has kids. It happened last year. It happened a year before that. Nine times out of ten, it's going to happen again. It's a pattern that's about to take place. Hoodie so in the building. Gay, sir. Gay, sir. So look. The number one thing y'all need to be prepared for. When their agenda starts sticking and stuff starts getting serious and they start noticing that a lot of people is affected by it. The number one thing that they always do is a random celebrity death. Now, I'm not I'm not trying to manifest. I'm not. I'm, I'm Listen, it's a pattern. It's, it always happened. It happened when they first released the first when Kobe died. It happened during the it's matter wars when all that shit when King Bomb, all type of people. Bro, listen. Celebrity deaths make shit stick. It works perfect with they shit. I know y'all really look at celebrities like they they this and that. They are nothing but puppets. They get used as pawns for their energy and distractions. I'm sorry to tell you this, but everything is not entertainment like you think. The first thing you got to be prepared for is a, a random celebrity. It's going to put the whole America at a vulnerable, deep, 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 sad trauma state. And then this war shit will become a nightmare. That's when they can keep feeding you dark, 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 death, dark stuff. So, number one, celebrity deaths. Be prepared for that. Number two, they already telling y'all right now that Russia, even if it's not happening, it can be a complete lie. America can be doing it to themselves. They said Russia is causing some type of trying to do some type of cyber attack and it's affecting. It could affect banking, the banking system. They telling you right now, that's a sign. They trying to get shit to go digital quicker than you think. That metaverse shit is coming faster than you think. I told you. 
Your whole entire family that don't know about crypto will be completely left out of the new reality. And they're going to be so slow and late, they're going to be broke and suffering. This crypto shit has nothing to do with this world. They trying to get everybody to live in this digital world so people don't focus on what's really taking place in reality. It's so obvious. Because reality, your reality is changing. But if you focus in the digital world, ain't shit going to change. You just going to die. I'm just being honest. One of the things I want to tell y'all, number one, be prepared for a celebrity death, which is going to make the war shit more intense and more sad and more deadly for these bots. And it can affect you. Number two, be prepared for this. Be prepared for them to be pushing this digital shit way faster. Number three, all of these trucker protesters been protesting. Bro, if you go in your grocery, the truckers that 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 ship the food all around the U.S., they all been protesting for a long time now. Look it up. If you look in your grocery stores, that fucking fruit is old as hell. It's molded. You got molded strawberries and fruit, all type of shit. And then it's all GMO. The fruit in America is completely done. I'm being honest. If you ain't growing your own fruit, even me, I'm affected by it. Dead ass. America is so different now. I'm trying to tell y'all. If you already got food and shit stocked up, you should be good. But if you need to restock, you better hurry the fuck up before they push fear. All these niggas go run and go and grab some tissue and all this before they do anything to push fear. Because I'm telling you, anything they do, these shot bots going to do it. And it's going to be way worse than it was before they got the... Because remember, now they scared. Now they in fear. Now they really think it's a fucking war. Remember, the media is controlling. It ain't no people. It's the media. It's like its own separate consciousness controlling humans. If all of us got wiped off the planet right now, but the internet still work, y'all know the media still be going on. It'll still be tweets, automatic tweets being posted. It's an autopilot system. It's demonic. So what I'm trying to tell y'all right now, I know you love your fucking family. They not going to wake up. When all this stuff start taking place, they ain't going to know how to stock up on the right food that you need. The motherfuckers going to be going to go get some tissue and shit. Your loved ones will be the reason why you fall. I'm trying to tell you this. And this is your motherfucking, your physical family. This not even your soul family and what you connected with. Motherfucking angelically, motherfucker, you a god. Do you know who the fuck you really are? So... Be prepared for all this negative energy to take place. It's nice and early. 2022, it's nice and early. They showed too much patterns. This is what they did last year. This is what they did the year before this. Something big is about to come, and we already would be prepared for it. But one thing I want to tell you that's going to affect everybody the most is celebrity deaths. Be prepared. Take care of yourself, man. It's so much other shit that I wanted to say to y'all. I had some notes and shit, but I just got thrown off topic. Y'all see I'm completely hot. Go within. Get this information. Do your own research. I'm going to leave some links in the description. I want y'all to check out these live footage from Ukraine. There's nothing happening there. I'm going to leave y'all some links in the description. It's important for you to do your own research and go within at this time. You should already know. Anyway, take care of yourself, man. I love y'all. Spiritual soul signing out, bruh.